In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, I believe in God, the Father Almighty, creator of heaven and earth, and in Jesus Christ, his only Son, our Lord, who was conceived by the Holy Spirit, born of the Virgin Mary, suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, died, and was buried, and he descended to hell, and on the third day he rose again from the dead, he ascended into heaven, and he said right hand, God, the Father Almighty, from there he will come to judge the living and the dead. Our Father, who art in heaven, how read thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on us in heaven. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord with thee. Blessed are thou among women, and blessed for thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord with thee. Blessed are thou among women, and blessed for thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord with thee. Blessed are thou among women, and blessed for thy womb, Jesus. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. The joyful mystery, the first joyful mystery, the annunciation of the Lord Jesus. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on us in heaven. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed for thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed for thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed for thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed for thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed for thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed for thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed for thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed for thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed for thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed for thy womb, Jesus. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. O oh, my Jesus. The second joyful mystery, the visitation of our Blessed Mother to her cousin Elizabeth. Our Father, who art in heaven, how read thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth in heaven. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed for thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed for thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed for thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed for thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed for thy womb, Jesus. 
Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed fruit thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed fruit thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed fruit thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed fruit thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed fruit thy womb, Jesus. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. O oh my Jesus. The third joyful mystery, the nativity of the Lord Jesus, our Father who art in heaven, how read thy name, thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth and in heaven. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed fruit thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed fruit thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed fruit thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed fruit thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed fruit thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed fruit thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed fruit thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed fruit thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed fruit thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed fruit thy womb, Jesus. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. O oh my Jesus. The fourth joyful mystery, the presentation of our Lord Jesus into the temple. Our Father who art in heaven, how read thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on us in heaven. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed fruit thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed fruit thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed fruit thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed fruit thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed fruit thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed fruit thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed fruit thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed fruit thy womb, Jesus. 
Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed fruit thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed fruit thy womb, Jesus. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. O oh my Jesus, the fifth joyful mystery, the uh, fighting of the Lord Jesus in the temple. Our Father who art in heaven, how read thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth and heaven. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed for thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed for thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed for thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed for thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed for thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed for thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed for thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed for thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed for thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed for thy womb, Jesus. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. O oh my Jesus, Hail Holy Queen. Pray for the Holy Mother of God. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. The Lord be with you. Let us go moving in silence and not God for mercy and pardon. Lord Jesus, you came to heal the contract heart. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Christ Jesus, you came to cause sin. Of Christ, have mercy. Christ, have mercy. Lord Jesus, you forgive us our sin. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. May Almighty God have mercy and forgive us our sin and bring us to the lasting life. Amen. Let us pray. O oh God, who have revealed that peacemakers are to be called your children, grant we pray that we may work with our season to establish that justice which alone ensure true and lasting peace. To our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who live and reign with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God forever and ever. <coughs> A reading from the book of the prophet Jeremiah. In the beginning of the reign of Zedekiah, king of Judah, in the fifth month of the fourth year, the prophet Hananiah, son of Azur from Gibeon, said to me in the house of the Lord, 
in the presence of the priests and all the people. Thus says the Lord of hosts, the God of Israel, I will break the yoke of the king of Babylon. Within two years, I will restore this place, all the vessels of the temple of the Lord, which Nebuchadnezzar, king of Babylon, took away from this place to Babylon. And I will bring back to this place Jeconiah, son of Jehoiakim, king of Judah, and all the exiles of Judah who went to Babylon, says the Lord. For I will break the yoke of the king of Babylon. The prophet Jeremiah answered the prophet Hananiah in the presence of the priests and all the people assembled in the house of the Lord and said, Amen, thus says the Lord, do. May he fulfill the things you have prophesied by bringing the vessels of the house of the Lord and all the exiles back to Babylon to this place. But now listen to what I am about to state in your hearing and the hearing of the people. From of old, the prophets who were before you and me prophesied, woe, war, pestilence against many lands and mighty kingdoms. But the prophet who prophesies peace is recognized as truly sent by the Lord only when the prophetic prediction is fulfilled. Thereupon the prophet Hananiah took the yoke from the neck of the prophet Jeremiah and broke it and said in the presence of the people, thus says the Lord, even so within two years, I will break the yoke of Nebuchadnezzar, king of Babylon, from off the neck of all the nations. At that, the prophet Jeremiah went away. Sometime after the prophet Hananiah had broken the yoke from the neck of the prophet Jeremiah, the word of the Lord came to Jeremiah. Go tell Hananiah this, thus says the Lord. By breaking a wooden yoke, you have forged an iron yoke. For thus says the Lord of hosts, the God of Israel, a yoke of iron I will place on the necks of all the nations serving Nebuchadnezzar, king of Babylon, and they will serve him, even the beasts of the field I give him. The prophet Hananiah, to the prophet Hananiah, the prophet Jeremiah said, Hear this, Hananiah, the Lord has sent you, and you have raised false confidence in this people. For this, says the Lord, I will dispatch you from the face of the earth this very year you shall die. Because you have preached rebellion against the Lord, that same year, in the seventh month, Hananiah the prophet died. The word of the Lord. Lord, teach me your statutes. Remove from me the way of falsehood and favor me with your law. Take not the word of truth from my mouth, and your ordinance is my hope. Let those turn to me who fear you and acknowledge your decrees. Let me let my heart be perfect in your statutes that I be not put to shame. Sinners wait to destroy me, but I pay heed to your decrees. From your ordinance I turn not away, for you have instructed me. Lord. Alleluia, alleluia. One does not live on bread alone, but on every word that comes from the mouth of God. The Lord be with you. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to Matthew. When Jesus heard the death of John the Baptist, he withdrew in the boat to a deserted place by himself. 
The crowd heard of this and followed him on foot from that house. When he did embark and saw the vast crowd, his heart was moved with pity for them, and he cured their sick. When it was evening, the disciple approached him and said, This is a de deserted place, and it is already late. Dismiss the crowd that they can go to the villages and buy food for themselves. He said to them, There's no need for them to go away. Keep them some food yourself. <clears throat> they, but they said to him, Five loaves and two fish are all we have here. Then he said, Bring them here for, to me. And he ordered the crowd to sit down on the grass, taking the five loaves and the two fish. Looking up to heaven, he said the blessing, broke the loaf, gave them to the disciples, who in turn gave them to the crowd. They all ate and were satisfied. And they picked up the fragment left over to a wicker basket full. Those who, had, those who ate were about 5,000 men, not counting women and children. The Gospel of the Lord. So when did you uh, hear today's gospel? When was the last time you hear today's gospel? You pay attention to go to church. That good. <laughs> that good. He thought we move with pity for them, and he cured their sick. What a beautiful the Holy Spirit inspired St. Matthew to write this gospel. The Lord Jesus' heart always moved with pity, always had compassion on the people. And he's suffering with us nowadays. But do we recognize the presence of him in our own life? Do we call out to him to help us so that we can work together to overcome all the obstacles that we have to face nowadays. As I reflect upon last week when I went on to my uh, retreat, I think a young generation nowadays, they are suffering. They are suffering tremendously. Yet, we have all the technology to teach them online. But the best way is always face to face, in the classroom, interact with the teacher. We are so afraid to live our life, and we will not take courage to be in the classroom to teach our own children, to teach our students. I'm not criticizing the teacher at all. But what happened nowadays is, I'm afraid if our young generation do not interact with the teacher, if they encounter the problem with their homework, with their study, who do they ask to help, for help? He thought it moved with pity, and he cured the sick. Let us pray, not only for the world, especially also our nation. We put all our obstacles, our all differences aside, work together so that we have the heart of the Lord Jesus to pass on our knowledge to the students, to teach them so that they be able to go on to, to be good leader of our nation 
in the future. Without the knowledge, who will take over our nation? Don't underestimate the power of prayer. God is always present among us. If we truly bow down to Him, if we are truly on our knee and ask Him for help, God will deliver us from all the obstacles that we face nowadays. May God be with the world. May God be with our nation. May God be with all the teachers who is ready, who are ready to plant their knowledge. May God be with all the students that they have the spirit to learn. And may God be with every one of us. Together, we'll build up our nation according to God's love. Bless you, Lord God, all creation, for through your goodness, could the bread to offer with us a given and human hands that met. It will become for us the bread of life. Bless you, Lord God, all creation, for through your goodness, we take wine to offer food of the vine, cook up human hands. It will become our spiritual drinks. Pray that my sacrifice and yours will be acceptable to God, the Father Almighty. May the seven sacrifice of your son, the King of Peace, offer on the sacramental side that signify peace and unity. Strengthen, we pray, O Lord, conquer among all your children through Christ our Lord. The Lord be with you. Lift up your hearts. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. It is truly right and just, our duty and our salvation always and everywhere to give you thanks. Lord, Holy Father, Almighty and Eternal God, true Christ our Lord, His death we celebrate in love, His resurrection we confess with living faith, and His coming in glory we await with unwavering hope. And so with all the angels, we pray you up with our end, we acclaim. Holy. You are indeed holy, O Lord, the fault of our holiness. Make holy, therefore, this gift we pray, by sending down your spirit upon them, let the do fall so that they may become for us the body and blood of our Lord Jesus Christ. At the time he was betrayed and entered willingly to his passion, he took bread, giving thanks, broke it, gave it to the disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and eat of it, for this is my body, which will be given up for you. In a similar way, when supper was ended, he took the chalice, again giving thanks. 
gave the child to his disciples, saying, Take this out of you and drink from it. For this is child my blood. The blood of you never lies in covenant will pour out for you and for many. For the forgiveness of sins, do this in memory of me. The mystery of faith we proclaim. Therefore, as we celebrate the memory of his death and resurrection, we offer you, Lord, the bread of life and the child of salvation, giving thanks that you have earth worthy to be in your presence and minister to you. Humbly we pray that partaking of the body and the blood of Christ, we may be gathered into one by the Holy Spirit. Remember, Lord, your church. Spread throughout the world and bring her to the full of charity. Together with Francis, our Pope, and Samuel, our Archbishop, hit our sister Bishop Jorge and all the clergy. Remember also our brothers and sisters who have fallen asleep in the hope of the resurrection and all who have died in your mercy. Welcome them to into the light of your office. Have mercy not all we pray that with the Blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of God, with the Blessed Joseph, her spouse, with the blessed apostles, and with all your sons to have done your will throughout the ages. We may merit to be co heir to eternal life and may pray and glorify you through your Son, Jesus Christ. Through him, with him, in him. O God Almighty Father, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, O glory and honor yours forever and ever. At the say of command and from the divine teaching, we dare to say, Our Father, Deliver us, Lord, we pray, from every evil, graciously grant peace in our day, that by the help of your mercy we may be always free from sin, and safe from all distress, that we await the blessed hope and the coming of our Savior, Jesus Christ. Lord Jesus Christ, who said to your past of peace I leave you, my peace I give you. Look not on our sins, but on the faith of your church, and graciously grant her peace and unity in accordance with your will, who live and rank with you and forever and ever. Amen. The peace of the Lord be with you always. Amen. Lamb of God. Behold the Lamb of God, behold him who takes away the sins of the world. Blessed are God to the supper of the Lamb. Blessed are the peacemaker, for they shall be called children of God. Thank you. 
Let us pray. <clears throat> Bestow on earth, we pray, O Lord, the spirit of charity, so that sustained by the body and the blood of your only begotten Son, we may effective in nurturing among all the peace that he had left for us, who live and reign forever and ever. Amen. The Lord be with you. Amen. May the blessed Normatica bless you, Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Go forth, the Mass is ended. <clears throat>